upset person in here that wouldn't come through until I would talk to them. Oh my God, y'all look so good. So you're through with your red flag thing? Yeah. Oh. That's good. Bree, stop it. <laughs> some good news. Yeah. Would you like that on this Wednesday? Here's a story that might just have you grabbing the tissues, but it's a sweet one. It is. A local soldier has come home from Afghanistan, surprised his family, too. We love these stories. Take a look. Here's News H Josh Scheinblum, live in Ellington with that story. Josh? Darren, and members of any family will tell you that time apart can be painful. Now imagine if there was a father who had to spend more than a year away from his children. It's a reality that members of military families live with every single day. But at least for one family in Connecticut, that's a chapter of their lives that, at least for now, is now over. I am so excited to have the magician come. A day at camp can be magical. Especially when there's a magician who stopped by. Big round of applause for magician Brian Fitch. At Camp Indian Valley in Ellington. It just so happens when it comes to this particular magician, he has a little more magic up his sleeve than on a normal day. What's your name? My name is Ethan. Because on this afternoon, he's being assisted by nine year old Ethan Christensen, a young man who isn't afraid to laugh at himself. We are going to play a game of dress up, which is a good thing because the joke is about to be on him. After 13 months apart, he'll soon be reunited with his father, Major Timothy Christensen, and Ethan has no idea. What kind of, what kind of hat do you call that, do you know? Military hat. A military hat. Have you ever seen one like that before? Yes. All he has to do is turn around. Let me take this, let me take this. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, don't let that touch the ground. Okay, can you give it to the guy behind you? That is also the correct rank. What? That is also the correct rank. Wow. You're going to return it to that guy behind you. Anyway, guys, what we're going to do next, do you want to just give it to that guy? <laughs> Sometimes to bring a family together, all it takes is a little magic. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Ethan wasn't the only surprised Christensen in Connecticut today. His sister, Emily, was also surprised by her father at the Hartford stage. For now, we're live in Ellington. Josh Scheinblum, News 8. Huh? Okay, here we go. I saw Fallon pull up. You saw who? Yeah, Fallon Kane. We know Fallon Kane. Come on, come on, gal. I got stuff to do. Do whatever she's telling you to do, Fallon. Wait a minute. It's too much TV, Grandma. Well, hey, get hey, it, there Auntie. You go, Susie. Hey. There you go, Susie. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Oh, hey. hey. When you feel. Hey. Hey. Young. I knew she was gonna cry. Oh, Hold <laughs> up, get in the sun so we can get the tears. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Baby girl, this is Madison's dad. He just returned from Iraq. Yeah. My dad is in Iraq. My dad is a cool walk.
Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought maybe she would go or something. Can we go home? Bye, Mom. Step with your legs away. Okay, Marjorie. They're going to have to sign her up for event. Welcome home. Thank you. What you should go for another maybe two years. And Madison was on the staff. Okay. Okay, Madison is going to go. Let me go to the office. Yes. Do you want to show Daddy where you sit and stuff? I'll be right back, okay? Yeah, Mommy has to sign you up. Give it Megan. Megan. Uh -huh. I'm going to go in and just say, you know, call her out in the hall. I'll show about pooper pants. Okay. Here, Get my box, Jonathan? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go, Jonathan. <laughs> hey, get your box, bud. <laughs> nope. That's my box. <laughs> oh, I love it. Hi, how are you? Welcome back. <laughs> oh, that's nice. We already surprised the older two. That was hilarious. But I think can we, can we I do think that uh, yeah, okay. I think that um, we could go and see them. What are you gonna tell? Um, I I've been in a hotel <laughs> in Paris. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 Who is that baby? I think they're just too shy.
What do you think, Elizabeth? Okay. When I call your name. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, where are you talk? We're gonna walk into Harmon's and surprise my mom. <laughs> that was an introduction. As 12-year-old Ryan Kuhn played soccer, <laughs> coming from behind the trees, she had no idea who was making his way toward the field. Oh, there's no way she'll see me right now. Then, from the sideline, come on, Cooner, get that ball. A familiar voice caught her attention. <laughs> Hi, Dad. How are you? Good. How are you? Is this a good surprise? Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good to see you. Father and daughter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I pulled a fast one on you, didn't I? Yeah. Back together again. It freaked me out. Because <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect him to come here. Major Chad Kuhn is back home after a nearly year-long deployment in Kosovo. Yeah, she's squeezing kind of tight. They saw each other briefly during his leave last month, but this time Kuhn is home to stay. Um, I miss her going to school for the first day this year. I missed her finishing school last, last year. I missed the whole summer. He's eager to catch up on lost time. They're like peas in a pod and good job, Ryan! <laughs> like he's been missing things like this. One, two, three. Right. Now, hey, Woo! ladies, give him a hand, all right? Woo! Coon says it's good to be home and have his daughter in his arms again. It's, uh, it's pretty awesome, actually, yeah.
family awaits a very special message from a soldier serving overseas. And you know what? We don't want to wait, keep them waiting any longer. Our Vicky Gonzalez standing by at the link. And Vicky, such a special moment tonight for the family of specialist Matthew Kelly. Absolutely. Specialist Matthew Kelly is currently in Kuwait serving our country. And he actually reached out to us from Kuwait just for his family who loves him so much and compliments of Caesars Entertainment. This family is going to get an entire night on the town starting right here at the High Roller and that's exactly where we are and I'm joined with the family a Specialist Kelly. This is John, his stepfather, his mother, Paula, Brandy and Andrea, his two sisters. So I mean just initially I know you guys have an outpouring of love but being his mother what does Matthew mean to you? Well you know, you don't think about them being gone and being in danger until something like this comes along. Then you realize how much you miss them. Matt's been gone a long time this time. And I just can't wait for him to get home. And him being your brother, your two sisters, what? I mean, do you guys get worried or are you proud? I imagine you're pet proud. Oh, yeah. I mean, you think of any soldier overseas, you're so proud of them for fighting for your country. But when it's your own brother, I mean, it just really pulls out your heartstrings. He means the world to us. We would be nothing without him. Well, compliments of Caesars Entertainment. You're going to get a whole weekend on the town. You're going to get an entire cabin at the High Roller Dinner at Off the Strip here at the Link, as well as tickets for your entire family to go see Olivia Newton-John summer night. So it's going to be a fantastic, fun-filled event. Now, I promised you a video from Matthew. We actually spoke in Kuwait, um, but I'm getting some word from our producer that I'm so sorry. We're having some technical difficulties. We're trying to get that as soon as possible, but I actually, um, I think I might have something a little bit better. What if Matthew joined you for this weekend? What if he actually joined you on the high roller and went to dinner with you and actually saw Olivia Newton-John with you because he's right there, actually. <laughs> Of course not. <laughs> you didn't even tell me. Come here, Mom. <laughs> right here live on News 3 Live at 7. A beautiful, we missed beautiful you. moment. We missed you too. I told you I'd get you guys one day. Yeah, you did. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. It <We're> did. <laughs> now welcome home. <laughs> you didn't tell me. <laughs> All right, Matthew, he actually reached out to us. This is a specific package just for your family. Compliments of Caesars. So what made you reach out to our newsroom? Well, you know, a lot of us back in deployment talked about surprising their families and very few of us went through with it. And I knew, I'm getting out of the Army in six weeks, I knew I had to do something big, and you know, I knew they wouldn't expect this. So, uh, no, I didn't expect it for a couple of weeks at least. You know, there's, there's nothing more I love than my family and I'll do anything for them. All right, well, let's bring everybody in here. It's not only the immediate family, it's the extended family. He has a huge family, a huge group of love and support. Doing, Looking forward to spending 10 days with Specialist Kelly as he's here back home you, in Southern you, Nevada. Hey, I hear. Not a dry eye here in our newsroom, and obviously you can see how much love he has with him. It's going to take him a while to get through all these hugs, but so well-deserved well, magic. And <laughs> when News 3 can be a part of moments and bring them to you on air, I think we have lived the highest calling of what we do as television journalists, and that is a thrill. You think about all the moms and dads who don't get to have that moment and who have it for generations. <laughs> We're glad to show you that moment tonight, exclusive to News 3 Live at 7. Specialist Matthew Kelly, welcome home.